Hello everyone, we're going to go through the process of creating your own QR code unique to you. So click on the email that we sent you and then you're going to follow the four following steps. First, we're going to go to the website. Once the website loads, then we're going to enter our first and our last name. So my name is Gregory and my last name is Patterson. So you'll notice as I'm typing Patterson and Gregory, this code on the right here is changing. Now that I've done it, and you can do this both on your computer at home or at work, or you can do it on your mobile phone to save it directly to your phone and bring it with you. So you can hit save and then choose a file name that will be easy for you to remember on how to look it up. So I'm going to use my name. And then I'm going to put QR code. This isn't going to change what the QR code reads. It's just going to make it easier for me to look up and find. Now I can see it's been downloaded. So I'm going to go to the download section. And notice right here, double click. And it's going to bring up my QR code. So when you bring that with you and you scan in, this is going to say Gregory Patterson every time. It's never going to change. Now if you don't have a smartphone or you don't have the ability to use that or know how to do that, you can just print it out right here on this website. So if you're using Google Chrome, you come up, click on these three buttons, and then come down and print. And what that's going to do is it's going to print everything that's on the screen right there. So once this loads, you're going to notice that there's a unique QR code, which is mine. It says Gregory Patterson. And then you're going to come over and click the print option. So once you've printed that out, you bring that with you. And then we can use that to scan you in. Or if you'd like, you can take a picture with your phone of the computer desktop of this square and bring that square, that picture with you saved on your phone. If you have any other questions or any other concerns, please feel free to email camawebsitehelp at gmail.com. And we hope you have a great day. Thanks a lot.